Hello, my name is Sherry Yannick, Churchill School Librarian. Today we are reading Deep Breath. Sometimes all you have to do is chill. And this book is by Carol Thompson. I hope you'll enjoy it. And it's really great to read when you're feeling stressed out or you feel like you need a moment, um, no matter what age you are. And that's one of my favorite things to do when I'm feeling stressed out or especially if I'm feeling angry and I feel like I might not be reacting in the best possible way. So to prevent that, I kind of like take a pause and just go. And even one deep breath really helps me. Dolly likes to play on her own. So here she is growing things. Looks like she's dancing, driving a car, um, riding a bike, vacuuming, dum dee dum dee dum. Especially the mirror game. So you can see the mirror game right there. But some games are not much fun all alone. Right? We need someone else for a seesaw, someone else to hit back and forth if you have like a little tennis racket or badminton. Then along comes Jack the Rabbit, Dolly's best friend in all the world. He goes, Wee! My tail is curlier than yours. My tail is rounder than yours. I like you this much. I like you more. I like your hair, Dolly. I adore your Dolly walk. You have such a nice face, Jack. I know. I like you the best. Some days Jack and Dolly are quiet together. They go to their best place and watch the clouds or listen to their favorite music. Some days they race around so fast and play so hard, all they can do is laugh. Jackie Wacky Noodle, Dolly Waddle Noodle. One day when Dolly goes to visit Jack, he is wearing a beret. I'm painting today, Dolly. Can I paint you? Only if I can paint you too. Jack paints a big circle and then some smaller circles. Dolly paints some long, wobbly lines. Dum dee dum dee dum. Dolly looks at Jack's picture. Jack looks at Dolly's picture. You made me look like a lumpy pumpkin. You made my ears look like slimy slugs. You're not my friend, Jack. I'm going home right now. And don't come back ever. I'm mad. He's not my friend. Jack's wrong. I'm sad. Right? So you can imagine a lot of emotions, especially if someone painted a picture of you, you didn't really like it, and you're of you, and it makes you feel not so great. But maybe they're just not the best painter, or maybe they saw you in a different way, right? Let's see what, what Rabbit says. I'm mad. She's not my friend. I'm sad. So they're feeling kind of the same way, right? If I don't calm down soon, I'll explode. Dolly takes a deep breath in, all the way in, and all the way out. <sighs> Dolly takes a lovely warm bath. She closes her eyes and thinks of something she likes a lot. So that something would be her friend. If I don't stop thinking about Dolly, that Dolly soon, I'll explode. Jack counts slowly up to ten and back down again. And up again. So he goes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So just try to distract himself and focus on something else and let the anger dissipate. <sighs> he closes his eyes and thinks of something he likes a lot. So look at what he's thinking that he likes a lot. The next day, Dolly goes to her best place and Jack goes to his best place. I miss you, Jack. I miss you, too. Right? So there was a comment. I miss you that much. I miss you this much. Let's be trees, Jack. I'm a bee, Dolly. Zzz. Zzz. 
This little piggy. Feeling better now, Jeff? We're both chill now. So this book was called Deep Breaths. I hope you enjoyed this great book with lots of information on how to relax yourself. So next time you're upset, taking some deep breaths or counting up and down can really help, really soothe you and calm you. Thanks so much for listening and keep humble.